Hello everybody. Uh, welcome back to Hardcore Survival. Um, so I wanted to quickly apologize for my last several videos um, being particularly loud. Uh, that being the environment being loud, the rain, digging, monsters, all that stuff. Um, and I know that I was particularly quiet. I've recently adjusted my microphone, adjusted my sound settings. Shouldn't be as much of an issue. We'll find out. I think it'll be. I think it'll be good. So, anyway, so where we last left off, um, I finished protecting my drop down through my shaft that goes straight to bedrock. So if I wanted, I could just jump down there right now from right here. I'm not going to do it right now, just a moment. And I've begun my, um, my storage room, my very, very big and specific storage room. Uh, look, I have more bones. Yeah. Um, so... Here I am on my skyblock, sort of. Uh, not actually that high off the ground or anything. Just, just get me out of away from away from monster monster area in in this vast forest, which I'm certain is teeming with uh, with dangerous things. So, but I'm thinking now I probably should go collect some more cobble if I want to keep building. And some dirt, so I can start a farm. I have dirt, okay. Uh, so I can continue building out on this sky, on this uh, this base, and um, yeah, that way I can that way I can maybe make a farm. Since I did say that I wanted to be really good about fulfilling all my needs, so I didn't have any chance of starving to death, falling to my death, um, all those things. So uh, I'm going to go back down and start start mining down through. Now that I've gotten to bedrock, start doing a, a branch off of my strip mine and collect some more cobble, as well as hopefully some ores, and then I'll come back up here and expand my expand my base a little bit. So, yep, here we go. So if we want to see what this looks like to jump down through this crazy pit, let's hope I don't I didn't miscalculate and die. <laughs> that would be really really embarrassing. So let's go. Bonk. Yes. <laughs> I love that. Every time I can't get over how awesome that is. How awesome it is to be able to just fall straight down to the bottom of the world. Ah. It, it just it, get, it makes life so much so much faster to get down here. You don't have to worry about about taking that fall damage. Um the climb up still takes a minute, so I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to be be good about, um, you know, let me try to be good about actually making this time worth it. So, let's go.
So I don't know how many episodes it's actually going to be until I get to the end, um, when I'm ready to, to actually take on the big bad Ender Dragon. But, um, you know, it'll be good. First I'll have to make it to the Nether. Um, and that that is going to be a challenge, I know. It, it, talk about hostile. Talk about hostile terrain. Which way should I build my farm out towards? This way? Yeah, why not? So I went 10 out before on the other side. So I'll do that again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I am going to keep the shift button down. 7, 8, 9, 10. There's a spider. What are you doing? I don't want you here. I don't like your kind. Um, building a mob track will help, too, just to have extra resources of various types, you know. for building building things growing things get that bone meal arrows for such an easy way to collect arrows obviously I need to learn more about alchemy I've, I, I haven't actually learned very much about it but I should before I go too crazy because I want I want to definitely I want to definitely have have some knowledge of what I want, of things I can protect myself with, and I just have to do that research um, when I'm ready. So, okay, farm time. So, I think that I should probably build it with dirt <laughs> and not cobble. Maybe I'll maybe I'll make the outline in the inside here with with cobble. And I'll make and I'll, I'll that way I sort of it's sort of nice and pretty, outlined with cobble. There we go. So, um, one, two, three, four. I'm trying to remember, I can can't remember all of a sudden. If I put a block, if I put a block of water. here, out there. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Will this work? I think this works. So if I do like one, two, three, then one, two, three, four, five, six, And what does this look like? Should have space right in the middle for water, I think. Yeah, that's right. Space right in the middle for water. And I know I'm running water down to the ground. I sort of forgot which key to hold down there. <sighs> At least I knew I was safe from fall damage. I knew it wasn't that far down. Um, but you... I am not safe from you, aren't I? Mm, spiders can climb walls. I remember that now. They won't last long. Not against me! Haha! -ha! I am... I don't need an enchantment of Bane of Arthropods. I am the Bane of Arthropods. Mwah. Mwah-ha-ha. -ha. There we go. Now I don't have to worry about water going down. 
Unless I want to use that as, a, as an extra route. I mean, that actually sort of makes sense too. Right? I could just have it as a as another way down. Why not? The farm is a way down. <laughs> let's let's just do that. Let's just do that. The farm is a way down. Um let's go ahead and protect it. I'll separate I'll do a couple of these, I think. All together like this. Maybe like a quad of them. That'd be cool. I'll have more than enough food that way. No way I'm going to run out of food if I do that. Um, which would be good. I'm happy with this. I'm happy with, with that. So I'll, I'll then create another separation here. So one, two, three. So seven. Seven by seven is what I'm doing here. I'll do four of those in a square. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait. Oh, I see what I did. Gotcha. I need one more. Fill that up with dirt, and I'll do another two. And I'll have each one of them in the middle will be a way down, if I if I so desire, and a way up, of course, and a way up. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that right? One, two, three. Yeah. Yes, that is correct. I'm going to need more dirt very soon, though. Did I do this one right? I'm doubting myself. Two, three, four, five, six. I did it wrong. So that's... I, I knew it felt wa wrong for some reason, and it's because I was one short on the end. Wouldn't have been a big deal, but it would have taken away from my symmetry. Toss and all I cobble down. What a waste. There we go. And I'll go ahead and build my one, two, three. Yeah. I should build an infinite water source up here too. Just it can't hurt to have have them all over. Certainly. Certainly can't hurt. Right. That way I don't actually have to go back down to get it. Um. Yeah. I guess I can make it close to the close to the I should probably make it close to the center actually. Um I could actually put it right here. Um although that would look a little funny, wouldn't it? Maybe I'll make a utility sort of strip over here. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's just... Don't want to run out of, of water. Oh, and I didn't make it big enough. And do I want to build down it in... No, I'm okay with having it up a little bit. So, there we go. That will also, I'll, I'll still allow this to be a, be a corridor branch. Um, just put the water in a really easily accessible, <laughs> I keep doing things like that. I, I have such clumsy fingers, apparently. Such clumsy mouse clicks. Um, there we go. Yeah. One half. There we go. Two. 
one more bucket of water, and I'll be able to keep everything wet. I'm going to need more dirt soon, though. I'll go ahead and just do that for now. I'm out of, out of cobble as well. Time for more mining. Build an extravagant base to, requires a fairly large amount of mining. So I guess we'll head back down. Um, no, not yet. I am going to remember light. Lighting is a good thing when it comes to new extensions. Keeps us from... Keeps us from, uh... Keeps us from spawning monsters where we don't want monsters spawned. Like all the way out here, for instance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... I wish I had one more cobble. That's okay. Um, oh gosh. Almost turned turned a little too quick there. Almost fell down. Um, I think I can go down to the main the main ground. Uh not underground. And and dig up some dig up some, some dirt and some grass. That way I can just get more seeds. That'll be good. Um I think I probably there's no reason to have a, a hoe any bit any any um any stronger or any better than than wood, really, I don't think. Except for durability's sake, but then I just have to come and make more, and wood is so plentiful, so. Um, but, speaking of wood, I should go ahead and make another axe, because while I'm out here, I might as well just pick up some more. Pick up some more, more wood. Okay, there we are. There we are. Great. Alright, it's daytime, perfect time to do this. So, um, and I'm casting a shadow now, aren't I? So, no need to keep things so dark. Now that I have a shadow cast around my area, keep it lit up. You know what? Now I need a shovel. Um, but I have I have my portable workbench, so we'll we'll go ahead and make a shovel then. Right here. Right here. Yeah, that's better. So let's just clear some stuff, get some resources from here. Hopefully, get some seeds. More dirt for the farm. It'll be a nice, big, big farm. I think I'll automate it with redstone. So I can just harvest from all of them. Be, that'll be nice. Be able to harvest from, from all of them at the same time when I'm ready to... I mean, I could set them up on separate ones too, but... I, there's just something sort of, sort of epic about walking into a quadrant of... Uh, of farms and hitting one button and harvesting a whole bunch of wheat all at once. I think that'll be pretty neat. I should get plenty of saplings this way too. So maybe on the other side of the farm, I'll make go ahead and make a, a forest, a, a tree harvesting section. I think that'll work well. Yeah. All right. Um, maybe I shouldn't dig too close to my uh, my base. Keep that area fairly untouched, so I don't so I don't end up creating holes or something that might lead to strange lighting areas that allows for more spawning of monsters. Mm -hmm. Getting all the seeds. 
All this grass, all this grass, giving me all their seeds. That's great. I'll just, I guess, I'll just work until it gets too dangerous, or until my stuff, all my tools break, and that should give me a good amount to work with. Then during the night, I can, I can work on building the base a little bit more. Because we want this base to have everything, absolutely everything that it can. Um, I want to be able to to maintain all my needs with it. So um, I already dug those. <laughs> I'm I'm forgetting where my where I've dug or where I've cut. Let's go to the let's go to the grassy areas. Get some more seeds. That was the whole point. Seeding up. I should have enough food to last me until the farm actually gets going, I think, so that'll be good. But uh, now it's dangerous. Now it's dark, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna stay close to home. But I do want to just sort of use up this, these tools real quick. I want to make sure I... I want to make sure that I, I get as much bang as I can right now. Uh. Flowers. Collecting those two, obviously. Maybe I'll change. Maybe I will end up recategorizing my my shells, my chests, to be like um, dyeables, things that make dyes, um, things that you can eat, things you can make tools with, things that you can build with. Categorize into sections in the storage or something like that. That would probably be smarter, honestly, but for now, I just don't want to... For now, I want to be able to search through things without without going through a bunch of different chests and and sort of searching through a huge... Um, just a huge uh, inventory of random stuff assorted in not a very logical way. Just put there... I, uh, that's just so frustrating. It's easy at first, but it's hard later, so... Might as well do the work up front, right? That's the plan. <laughs> Learn from our mistakes. Procrastination is not a... is not a... is not our friend. It may feel great at first, but... it's so not our friend. It'll lead us... lead us into... despair. Procrastination will lead us into despair, and... and... It will awaken the evil demons that wish to wish for us to forsake our our hardcore safety needs. So I think I think the key to playing in hardcore, the key is safety and efficiency. Um, don't waste resources. Don't. Uh, as much as possible. I, I probably am really guilty for wasting resources like crazy. Um, being like, oh, I can get more cobble later, letting it fall off the edge of the world, and as I break down my skyblock area, I am probably so very guilty of that. Um, but that's okay. You can really get some infinite cobble, so it's not such an issue. And dirt is so plentiful. It just does take time to get. That's true. It does take a little bit of extra time to actually go get it. So, I guess on the same note of being organized up front, I could also learn to be a little bit more careful with my resources. I I think that that's fair. That's a fair thing to say. Be a little more careful, not not being so willing to lose it. Overall, it would probably it would probably end up netting me more time and less frustration. So. It's probably a good idea. <laughs> it's probably a good idea. How many uses does an axe have? An iron axe? I don't know, actually. I never learned those numbers for how many uses each type of tool has. I just sort of go with it, you know? Like I said, I learn a little bit from my brother and then... then strike out on my own. Looking for what the what the road has to offer. 
there is no road here. I mean, I could find a village. If I find a village, that'd be cool. I'm sure I'll find something, but not until I'm ready to explore towards uh, a uh, stronghold. Because there's no reason for it. You know, I have everything I need up in my up in my base and and down underground. I've got everything I ever I could ever need. All right, this guy, he's gonna he's gonna have to go. Yeah, I'm gonna get you. And you, you too. And not you. I'm not touching you. I'm not not touching that. But now I'm starving, which means I can't sprint. So maybe I am touching you. Oh wait. Oh wait. Oh wait. Oh, don't you blow up. Oh wait. Ah, gotcha. They're not so bad if, you know, single player. There's no no real too much not too much lag. They're not so bad. They're not so tough. They're not so tough. You can you can pretty much avoid being hit completely. Might as well get some more piggy. Come here, you. Come here, pig. Thank you. Yeah, but I'm not I'm not gonna do something crazy and like go into that little swarm of mess. No. Not 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 that daring. We are safe. We are peaceful hardcore extravaganzas extra uh ex adventurers. Extravaganzas. <laughs> I don't know what I don't even know what that is. Um people who are extravagant. Maybe. I'm not that extravagant. Just wearing I'm just wearing Hey, I. Why am I Steve? That's unfortunate. My skin's not showing up. I guess that happens from time to time. Maybe next time. I didn't even notice before. Liao means. Well, it's lion. So, come on. I'm a lion. I'm a peaceful lion. I like to I like to farm and dig up dig up seeds for wheat because I'm a peaceful lion. <laughs> I like to I like to go along my merry way and I don't I don't want to I don't want to get creeped on. No, that's not very nice. I don't want to get creeped on. I just want to live in peace. I just want to just want to collect my wood and live in peace and harmony with the world. There's nothing wrong with that, right? Hmm. This is a big tree. There's a lot of there's a lot of uh there's a lot of extra branches sticking off of it. Um I still have some uses left in my axe, but I think I'm actually gonna call it for now. Uh just finish off this stump. I'm gonna go back and and finish building onto that uh that farm right here. So glad I can climb up waterfalls. So glad. Makes it pretty easy to get back up here. As long as I don't fall. Ooh. Danger. Okay. Now I have a lot more stuff. So let's go ahead and fill this all in. That water's probably gonna remain thick like that, but that's okay. I don't actually mind. It actually helps getting up and down, making getting up and down easier, so. No, it's actually not. It looks like they... Yeah, it is. It is, actually. It is going to stay thick like that. It just drops down a level. It's all good. Like I said, makes getting up and down easier, so. Can't be out of dirt already. No, I've got lots of dirt. I've got lots of dirt. I'm sort of getting hungry. Not in game, but you know, in life. Maybe I should. Uh, maybe I should pause for <laughs> for food. I haven't actually eaten yet today. Um, I I don't have any cobble. I didn't. I forgot about that. Can't finish my outlines without the cobble. But I can. I guess I can do everything. But we'll do that. I'll do everything but the outlines. I, should, I, I don't know if I actually even have enough dirt to fill everything in yet, but we'll know soon enough. We'll know soon.